Welcome back to the Collector's Channel, where I give you my LEGO investing opinion. This is for entertainment value only. It is not financial advice. Today, I'm looking at a set that is rapidly becoming extinct in the wild. We are looking at the LEGO Harry Potter 76394 Fox Dumbledore's Phoenix set. 597 pieces, one minifigure, along with one animal. The Dumbledore minifigure is exclusive and goes for between $8 and $10. This figure should gradually go up in value since LEGO will probably never make this exact version of Dumbledore again, but I don't expect it to go up too much. Maybe it could reach that $12 level within the next 12 to 18 months. The Fox figure in this set is not exclusive. It is in another set and goes for around $3 to $4. In the U.S., this is a Target exclusive set, and it should do very well now that it's retired. The retail price is $39.99, but Target has been selling it for $49.99, which is a little shady on their part. Normally, the retailer that has exclusive rights sells it at LEGO's retail price, but in any event, I hope no one passed on this set because of what appears to be Target's continuous war on resellers. If you were lucky enough to get this one at 20% off, you paid $31.99 for it. The release date was June of 2021. This set officially retired in November of 2022, but it looks like there are still a few on Target shelves in the US. All of the inventory will soon be gone, so if you do see this set at a Target, don't hesitate to go out and get it. LEGO has released a similar style set of Hedwig, set number 75979, and that set actually came out before the Fox set, but that one has not retired, and that one came out in August of 2020. So this set will be a little more rare and will most likely be a better investment than the Hedwig set. I regret only buying a handful of these sets. I think this set is going to be a home run. It is a very unique set with the flapping wings function and it will most likely not be made ever again in this price range. We could see more of a UCS style set, but I really believe at this $40 price level, I do not see LEGO making another set like this ever again. So my prediction, after one year of retirement, I think this one will go to $80 plus shipping. So at $80, your profit at retail would be $24, and your profit if you got this one at 20% off would be $32 per set, which is very good when we're talking about only one year after retirement. My prediction in two years after retirement I think we'll see another small jump to around $90 I think this could get to hundred dollars but I wanted to be a little conservative since 90 is already more than a double on this set your profit after two years of retirement and $90 would be $32 if you paid retail and $40 if you got this one 20% off now my prediction in three to five years after retirement I really believe that this one will go to at least $110 plus shipping I think $110 is really the bottom of where this set will be for sure four to five years from now, but even at that three years after retirement level, I think it will hit $110. And at $110, your profit if you bought this at retail is $48. If you got this one 20% off, it is $56. In all these cases, from all these scenarios, from year one to five after retirement, this set by all accounts is going to be a home run. So those of you that missed out on this set, use this as a teaching moment and be sure to evaluate sets like this at least three to six months before retirement. It looks like I will end up with only six of these sets well short of my goal. I would have liked to have gotten 20 of this set, so I did fall short on this one. Here is my recap of where I think this set is headed. So that is my LEGO investment prediction on this set. Please like and subscribe to the channel and leave any comments on what you think about this set. If you have a set that you would like me to review, please drop that in the comments as well. There are many more videos on the way. Thanks for watching and keep building your LEGO empire.